With electric vehicles, EVs becoming the new norm, the scramble for essential battery components like cobalt has reached a fever pitch. This surge has triggered a fierce competition among car and battery manufacturers to discover alternatives to the reigning champions, nickel cobalt aluminum, nickel cobalt manganese, and lithium iron phosphate batteries. The quest to find a solution that's better, cheaper, lighter, and more efficient. After all, batteries are the most expensive part of any EV. But hold on, there's some electrifying news on the horizon. Picture a battery that's not only more cost-effective, but also lighter and super efficient. Sounds too good to be true, right? Well, the world's top two battery giants, Cattle and BID, have teamed up to introduce a game-changing sodium ion battery. This innovation could revolutionize the EV industry. So, what makes sodium batteries so special? And when will they start powering our rides? Let's embark on a thrilling journey into the world of Chinese sodium ion batteries. Imagine sodium as the superstar of the periodic table, ubiquitous and easy to find as it's a major component of table salt. Unlike lithium, which demands extensive and costly mining, sodium is a breeze to extract. Sodium ion batteries capitalize on this abundance using cheaper raw materials, which makes them a hot prospect for EV manufacturers and battery buffs alike. The best part, sodium sells for just 1 to 3% of lithium's price. Its chemical similarities to lithium give it a competitive edge in the battery arena. Thanks to recent breakthroughs, sodium ion batteries have become serious contenders. They now boast the ability to be recharged daily for years, challenging one of lithium batteries' biggest selling points and putting an end to range anxiety. Their energy capacity has also seen a dramatic increase. Here's a fun fact. The pioneering research on sodium batteries began in the 1970s in the United States. Fast forward to about a dozen years ago, and Japanese researchers made significant strides, bringing sodium batteries closer to mainstream use. So buckle up, because the sodium-powered revolution is just around the corner, promising a future where electric vehicles are not only greener, but also more affordable and efficient. Here's where our story takes an unexpected twist. Chinese companies have taken the lead in commercializing this technology, and they're not holding back. Out of the whopping 20 sodium battery factories planned or already under construction worldwide, a staggering 16 of them are in China. In just two years, China is projected to hold nearly 95% of the world's sodium battery production capacity. Sodium ion batteries have a big advantage when it comes to recycling. They're easier to recycle and don't require those elusive rare earth elements that are associated with lithium. Plus, sodium batteries keep almost all of their charge even when temperatures plummet below freezing. Meanwhile, lithium batteries tend to lose their charge when the snowman pays a visit. Lithium and rare earth elements have been plagued by shortages and crazy price spikes. On the other hand, sodium hydroxide, a key component of sodium ion batteries, remain significantly cheaper. Lithium hydroxide has skyrocketed over 1,000% in just two years, while sodium hydroxide is still hanging around at a fraction of the cost. Sodium is clearly the budget-friendly choice here. But what about performance? We can't forget about that. Lithium ion batteries are known for their high energy density and power, which is why they're the go-to choice for performance and long-range Tesla models. However, there's a catch. Lithium ion batteries have a not so fun safety issue called thermal runaway. You might have heard stories of electric vehicles catching fire or even worse, exploding. Thankfully, sodium ion batteries don't have this problem. Now let's take a look at who's leading the race in sodium ion battery development. It's no surprise that China is taking the lead. Catiel and BID, two Chinese companies, have been working hard to bring sodium ion batteries to the masses. Katiel revealed that these batteries have an impressive energy density of 160 kilowatt hours per kilogram, slightly lower than another battery type called LFP. The evaluation of patents for sodium ion batteries shows China leading the pack, leaving Japan and the US in the dust. Chinese companies are even gearing up for mass production this year. They're not wasting any time. Speaking of Japan and the US, 
they're also in the race to find alternative batteries for their decarbonization efforts. They recognize the need for more sustainable options. However, they're currently playing catch up with China. According to Nikki, the business publication, as of December, there were a staggering 9,862 patents in force, marking a mind blowing 12 fold increase over the past decade. China has a whopping 5,486 patents, which account for more than 50% of the total. Japan used to hold the crown until 2015. Well, they're still in the game with 1,192 patents, followed by the US with 719 South Korea, with 595, and France with 128. These batteries are true game changers. They're more cost-effective to manufacture. That means more affordable and accessible batteries for all of us car enthusiasts. These bad boys perform exceptionally well in low temperatures, making them perfect companions for those chilly winter drives. Chinese sodium ion batteries boast enhanced safety features, giving you peace of mind on the road. Katy L, the genius behind these batteries, has even bigger plans up their sleeve. They're gearing up to unveil their upcoming sodium ion batteries, which will boast an energy density that exceeds a mind-boggling 200 watt-hours per kilogram. These cutting-edge batteries are slated to hit mass production by 2023. Cattail's first-generation sodium ion cells are already impressively affordable, costing just $77 per kilowatt hour. But get this, the second generation, which is set to enter volume production, will bring that jaw-dropping cost down even further to a mind-blowing $1.40 per kilowatt hour. Chinese battery executives spilled the beans in interviews, revealing that they've cracked the code on making sodium battery cells similar to lithium ones. In fact, they've developed a way to use both sodium cells and lithium cells in a single electric car's battery pack. You get the low cost and weather resistance of sodium cells along with the extended range of lithium cells. Back in 2021, experts were skeptical about the potential of sodium ion batteries. They thought these batteries were only good for specific applications like energy storage. Even the big shots at KTL, the Chinese battery manufacturer, were a bit on the fence. Some even suspected that Cattle's sodium ion battery venture was just a clever strategy to pressure lithium suppliers into lowering their prices. But were they in for a surprise? Fast forward to 2022, and the landscape starts to shift dramatically. As the development of sodium ion batteries gained traction and lithium prices skyrocketed, it became crystal clear that sodium ion batteries had the potential to be a serious contender in the electric vehicle game. And in November 2022, KTL dropped the bombshell. They officially confirmed that their sodium ion batteries were primed and ready to power the electric vehicles of the future. Not wanting to be left in the dust, BID, another major player in the EV arena, jumped on the sodium ion bandwagon. They announced their plans to kick off mass production in 2023 and bring forth a compact electric hatchback running on sodium ion battery power. At the recent Shanghai Auto Show, cattle shook things up once again. They proudly proclaimed that their sodium ion batteries would find a new home in the Sherry iCar, which is set to hit the market by the end of this year. Likewise, BYD is going full steam ahead with their sodium ion batteries entering mass production in the second half of the year, starting with their majestic Seagull. In November 2022, KTL dropped the bombshell. They officially announced that their sodium ion batteries are going to be the power source for electric vehicles in the future. Talk about a game changer. Sodium ion batteries bring some serious benefits to the table. First off, safety. They've got an upper hand in that department, which is always a plus. They're pretty cost effective too, but like anything in life, they've got their limitations. You see, when it comes to energy density, they're not quite on par with the lithium ion champs. So to match the energy capacity of their lithium ion rivals, we're going to need more sodium ion batteries in the mix.